Hello, in this problem we are going to find this limit. We're taking the limit as x approaches 0 of 1 over x minus 1 over sine x. This problem is from a book called Calculus, and it was written by a mathematician, and his name is Michael Spivak. And basically if you plug in 0, which is like the first thing you're supposed to really do when you're evaluating limits, you get 1 over 0 here, and you get 1 over sine 0, which is 0, so it's 1 over 0 here. So none of this makes sense. So my first thought um, is to perform the subtraction here. So this is really the limit as x approaches 0. I have not done this problem. And the LCD here is going to be x times sine x. So basically, um, I guess I'll show you some extra steps. So basically, you're going to do this. This is not how I do it. I usually just skip all this, but I'll show you. You multiply by one so that you can create a common denominator. Okay, so this would be sine x minus x over x sine x. So how do I actually do it? I just go from here to here. Um, I just say it's one times what's missing here to get the LCD sine x minus one times what's missing here to get the LCD x. So you can go from here to here. That's typically how I do it. Now if you plug in 0, uh, you get 0 over 0, because you get sine of 0, which is 0, minus 0, so you get 0, and you get 0 on the bottom. So whenever you have this indeterminate form, 0 over 0, what you can do is you can use something called L'Hopital's rule. L'Hopital's rule basically says that you take the derivative of this, and you take the derivative of the bottom here. The bottom is a product, so we're going to have to use the product rule. Recall if you have a function f and a function g and you want the derivative, think of f as the first and g as the second, so it's the derivative of the first times the second plus the first times the derivative of the second. Okay, so let's do it now. This is the limit as x approaches zero. The derivative of sine is cosine minus the derivative of x is one. Boom. On the bottom here, we'll use the product rule. The derivative of the first is one times the second plus the first, which is x, times the derivative of the second, which is cosine x. All right, and uh, let's see what happens here. Oh, it's still zero over zero. <laughs> I thought would be, I thought we would be done. I failed, no. Okay, so if you plug in zero, uh, you get cosine of zero minus one. That's one minus one, that's zero. So, and on the bottom it's clearly zero because sine of zero is zero and here it, x is zero. So zero over zero. So again, we can use L'Hopital's. I guess not fail. It'd be worse if like, we couldn't use L'Hopital's and we got stuck, then, then that, would be, that would be bad. Uh, taking the derivative of cosine, we get negative sine. The derivative of negative one is zero, so it goes away. Derivative of sine is cosine. Oh, look at this. We have to use the product rule again. Derivative of x, this is the first, second. Derivative of the first is one times the second plus the first times the derivative of the second, which is negative sine x. Good stuff. So this is equal to, let's see, limit x approaches zero, negative sine x over uh, cosine x plus cosine x is two cosine x. And then here we have minus x sine x. I think we finally reached a point where we can plug in zero and it's not gonna be zero over zero. Let me show you. So this is negative sine of zero over 2 cosine 0 minus 0 times sine of 0. Sine of 0 is 0. Cosine of 0 is 1. So you get 0 over 2, so you get 0. Boom, that's the answer. We did it. Pretty cool. Kind of an interesting problem. You just basically had to first subtract and then just use local tolls twice. Not really that difficult, but Definitely like harder than like, you know, easier problems, um, but definitely not like super hard or anything. Just uh, a little bit harder. If you didn't know to do this, like if you didn't do this, then I don't know how you would do it. Perhaps there's other solutions. This is just the first one that um, came to mind. So hopefully you've learned something uh, from this video. Good luck.